people listening into the show and, and some of them are playing their tunes and others are just listening and it's just like my Twitter feed's lighting up tonight so it's obviously uh, people are as excited as I am about the show which is really cool to hear so, and loads of others I've probably missed but just off the top of my head I just wanted to say uh, you know, speaking you know, of missing. you know I'm just glad you mentioned the shout outs because speaking of shout outs um, just so you know Gina I know you're listening uh, I did decide I know I would say I would slip it in and I'm going to so Fall in Love will be the last song of part 2 tonight because it's a fantastic tune and I can't get enough of it so just so you know That'll be the last tune of the night will be Fall Love, uh, Hands of Blue Band, a really cool song. So next awesome. up, we're going to get to a couple of cover tunes and uh, a band called Tess of the Circle. And they're doing a cover of Higher Ground uh, by Stevie Wonder. For those uh, people who know the original and the original is not done by the Chili Peppers, although it's a good version of it, it's not the original. The original is Stevie Wonder, who, by the way, is great live and saw that tune live and what a fantastic tune it is. So here you go with Tess of the Circle and their cover of Higher Ground by CB Wonder. Dig this. And it's hard. We all make excuses sometimes. In our life And it's hard We all have the devil in us Late at night In our minds You drag me to his higher ground You drag me to his higher ground It's higher ground And it's hard You drag me to this higher ground You pull me through I'm safer now You drag me to this higher ground And I don't ever want to come back down It's hard We all see the different sides We all see our different ways of life You drag me to his higher ground You drag me to his higher ground You drag me to his higher ground is hard. You drag me to his higher ground. You pull me through, I'm safer now. You drag me to his higher ground. And I don't ever want to come back down. circle with the higher ground now a very cool acoustic track uh, i it, it, you know, it had it had a great vocals to it and it is a cover but another cover i initially thought it was but i'm not sure what it is but that's what it comes up as but either way it's a great tune i love the vocals to it love the flow like a very good acoustic tune 
yeah, that's a really, really cool tune. I, I really, really enjoyed that. It's uh, it's not what I was expecting because I've, I've got the Stevie Wonder one in my head, but I, 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 I don't know if it's a cover of a different tune or just a version of it I don't recognise or whatever, but whatever. It's a really, really cool tune. <laughs> um, and it, it, it actually inserted a nice little bit of mellow that we probably needed just to, to break up the heavy in part two. So nice playlisting once again, Dr. Bones. Give yourself a pat on the back there. Um, yeah, these guys are brilliant, and that was a really, really cool tune. I want to hear more and more and more of their stuff uh, because I think they're awesome. Right on. Well, next up, we do have a cover that we all know. And this is by a band who will be playing at the Sussex Music Festival, a band called Acoustics. And the song is called Tainted Love, and it's a cover, it's a cover of the Soft Cell song. Dig this. <laughs> Acoustics, a great cover of Tain of Love by Soft Cell. Like, I really enjoy that one. Like, I never heard it done that way. Uh, pretty much all acoustic, obviously, hence the name Acoustics, but a great tune. I like, love that song. Great track, great cover. Yeah, they're a fantastic band. They're actually, um, they're another band that are playing at the Sussex Music Festival. They played last year. And they were kind of the crowd favourite, apparently. Uh, Sabrina was saying on that on the interview the other day. So they're back uh, this year by popular demand. Um, it's a three-piece band. So they um, they got uh, vocals, obviously uh, electric and acoustic guitars, uh, and there's a double bass. Um, I think the, I think the bass player plays a double bass or a bass guitar, depending on the song. There's a double bass, which is really cool. It's always nice to see a stand-up bass uh, in a band. And uh, and yeah, they do stuff like that, which is awesome. That's a fantastic cover. I've, I've got a feeling. Um, You'll correct me, I'm sure if I'm wrong. I've got a feeling Marilyn Manson did an amazing cover of that song. He did, um, absolutely. More did. different <laughs> to the version we've just heard. Um, but uh, it's, it's amazing. I was thinking about it just now. I was thinking, well, I talk about Marilyn Manson quite a lot on this show. It's obviously something that's either influenced me quite a lot or perhaps influenced you know, everyone else, whether or not they realise it. Um, well, but anyway, that's a complete sidetrack. Uh, uh-huh. Mountain is awesome, by the way, but uh, exactly. acoustics are fantastic, and they're going to be, you know, brilliant on a big stage with 500 people at the Sussex Music Festival. So, can't wait to check that one out as well, man. Let's see, Manson is just badass. So that, that there's nothing else to say about him. So next Absolutely. up, we have a brand new one by a band called From Apes to Angels. It's been a long time since we put them on the show. A long time since they've had something new out. They just sent this to me the other night. 
So here we go, the brand new one by Apes the Angels. This one's called New Skin. Dig this. From Apes to Angels, New Skin. That was a really cool electronic synth pop song, and I haven't heard anything from them in a long time, so that was a really good tune. I loved her vocals. Like, very, very... Well, it flowed so well. I mean, they did such a great job. I mean, it was a, it was a great beat to it, a great hook to it. It's a great tune. Yeah, absolutely. It had that uh, massive snare drum that... Um... Oh, I can't remember the song, but uh, there's a Simon and Garfunkel song, weirdly, that's got a massive snare drum in it, it's just like that. Uh, her vocals are just glassy and really, really nicely put together. Uh, the whole thing is really cool, and I love the little, um, I want to say kind of twinkly keys, but that's the wrong word, but you know what I mean? Just the, right. the way that that kind of uh, went along and, and kept the kind of groove and the pace uh, with those little licks on the keys I thought was awesome. That's a really, really nice uh, kind of electro synth pop tune. Um, that's, that's that's in my collection uh, for um, you know mellowing out after a gig and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> that's on a playlist somewhere. It's proper good. 
Right on. So next up, we have Tucson Tattoo tonight. The next one up is Damsel in the Dollhouse. This is off her new.